the first 14 through 19, they give you M and B. Slope is M, remember, B is the y-intercept. So this would be y equals 0x plus 4. Now, we don't have to simplify it because it does say to write it in slope-intercept form. So you could leave it like that. But if you did simplify, what would it just be? Um, y equals 4 because 0x is nothing. So then 20 through 25, you're doing the same thing. It's just the B is where it crosses, and then you gotta find the slope, rise over run, and then you write the equation. 23, 24, and 25, you've got three equations for each one. So they're done just like 20 through 22, it's just you gotta write A, B, and C, three equations. Now, if you remember, when you look over at 25 here, they're all horizontal lines. So what's the equation of this? A. Zero. No. Equals four. Y equals 4 because it crosses the y axis at 4. Okay? Remember, if it goes straight up and down, it's x equals whatever number it goes to. So 14, 0, 14, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Right here? Yep. 0x plus 4, or you could write it as y equals 4. These last two, you don't use y and x. Um, you use p and t. So the p is like the y, the t is the x. So you do it the same way. Now remember, um, slope, when you're doing a word problem, Slope is the same thing as the change, rate of change. B is the starting point, the initial point. <coughs>